So in this short part two video, I'm out using the SciRide SysNav Variometer. So a couple of weeks ago, uh, before the rain started here in San Diego and before the whole world was turned upside down, I was able to get out and use the SysNav Variometer. Really a nice little unit. You can see here I have it tethered to my riser. It has a little safety line there. The display is excellent, very easy to read. I may just customize it a little bit more, uh, make some of the readings a little larger. I uh, also noticed that I had it on a what they call lifty air and so this little thing was buzzing at me the whole time even though I was just flying straight so I will change that and turn that off and uh, it was just a nice day to get to know the unit and hopefully I'll be up there thermally very soon. So thanks for watching. This has just been a really short video, just letting you get a flavor of the Vario as I'm flying at Tori. Hopefully I'll be up there thermally soon and get a better overview of how this uh, Vario works. Because of the coronavirus pandemic, I won't be flying at Tori for a time. Yes, I'm in that category of elderly individuals, as they call it, most likely to get infected. It's easier for me to pass this on to others, as well as stress the healthcare system just by needing to be hospitalized. So I'm staying at home these days. I can work through a form of telemedicine, which is what I'm doing. But if I can get out for a solo hike and fly, I'll post more videos on the Vario when thermally. But for now, there's just a lot of rain in the forecast. As some of you may know, my background is in science and medicine. If you haven't already done so, please routinely go to the CDC and WHO websites, as well as your local healthcare organizations for timely updates. Just staying on top of what's going on locally and in the world. Any pathogen, and especially this virus, does not discriminate on basis of anyone's politics, personal or social media opinion, place of origin, celebrity or wealth status, or any religious affiliation. So please listen to the experts and follow the recommendations. If we all work together and cooperate, we can mitigate the worst case scenario of this infection and save literally thousands of lives. So fly safe and above all, stay healthy.